I have a question. Yep. So uh, thank you for this interesting talk. Um, have you tried linking um, the content of these emails maybe to other character traits? Let's say something like the big five, say neuroticism, conscientiousness, and so forth. Or I, I, yeah. possible? I, I think it would be possible, yeah. OK. Uh, I have a question about the slide 19. I think uh, it shows the comparison. Yep. Yeah. So some of the comparison you made looks a pretty marginal difference to me, but that's because maybe I don't know the detail. Did you do the, did you, did you compute some uh, significant test to, to see that difference is actually statistically significant? Yeah, because the email, the number of emails are, you know, are available for different persons. Um, I have to admit that the Enron emails, they, they got pruned somehow for some certain amount. So that was the email, based on the email was available to us. You know, so it is like in our method it is based on these emails available. And so it's based on that statistics. So there are limitations to these numbers. Okay. Um, no. Um, I might have another question. It's it's just a small one, but I was wondering how many emails there were. Sorry if I might have missed it. Um, I forgot to get the exact numbers of uh, all the persons here. So like we have uh, 43 for all of them. Uh, we have charts that uh, like how many emails are for each person in a paper. So the paper is uh, is this one. Sorry, the paper is on the third slide. And so we have a detailed uh, information for how many emails for each person, but uh, some of the um, guilty persons, they don't have many emails. That's the same, yeah. Okay, thank you. I will say that uh, the work you do uh, is uh, interesting to apply. It's not about the motion detection, but uh, you know, since you now uh, you are working on atmospheric science field, mm -hmm. <laughs> so mm -hmm. there was a, a study uh, by uh, actually a good friend of mine that uh, they worked together with the Facebook and they tried ah. to detect the word you, uh, people posted in Facebook to find the wire fire basically when there is a wire fire happening people basically posted in facebook about you know oh you know there is a bad air pollution here and there so they use basically text mining to get the like you know air quality information so i mean I, so i think that will be interesting we can think about how we could reuse this apply this to the our you know new field yeah that sounds interesting Okay, I, I think that there are no more questions. I don't see any in the chat yet. No, I don't, yeah. <laughs> okay, so thank you so much, Doris, for your interesting talk. Um, yeah, and... If anyone is interested in or have a question that uh, couldn't, you know, uh, ask here, they can always email to Doris. She's yeah, here. Yeah. Yeah, so she she will be available to follow up uh, any potential questions. So I think thank you for the nice talk, Doris. Thank you all. Okay.
Bye. Bye.